well my dear students the course is labor policy pakistan and the topic is in validity pension or jo relevant section hai wo section 23 hai of the employees old age benefits act 1976 dear students section 23 deals with in validity pension an insured person who sustains in validity pension shall be entitled to an in validity pension at the rate to be calculated according to the formula set out in the schedule provided that a contribution in respect of him were paid for not less than 15 years or contribution in respect of him were paid for not less than 5 years since his entry into insurable employment and for not less than 3 years during the period of 5 years preceding the month in which the in which he sustains in validity and my dear students in either case he is under 60 years of age or 55 years in the case of woman provided that यहां पर फिर प्रोविजो आ गया प्रोविजो के बारे में आपको पता है कि जो बात ऊपर की गई है उसके साथ अब एडिशन कंडीशन या एक्सेप्शन अटैच हो सकती है आइए देखते हैं प्रोविजो क्या कहता है पढ़े हैं हम इनवैलिडिटी पेंशन प्रोवाइडेड दैट वेयर द एम्प्लॉय वाज इंश्योर्ड अंडर द प्रोविजन ऑफ दिस एक्ट ऑन और बिफोर थर्टी जून टू एंड द कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन पेबल अंडर द एक्ट बाय द एम्प्लॉयर prior to 30th june 2002 in respect of said insured person had not been paid the insured person my dear students shall enjoy the rights under this act as it as if for the word payable the word paid were not substituted in clause a and b provided further that where the contribution under section 9b is paid regularly by the insured person himself in accordance with prescribed procedure his entitlement to the benefit shall not be affected by default in payment of employer's share of contribution under section 9 sub section 2 subject to regulations the invalidity pension shall be payable from the month following that in which the insured person satisfies the conditions for entitlement thereto provided that the invalidity pension shall not be paid retroactively for more than 6 months preceding the month in which as application for the invalidity pension is submitted my dear student subsection 3 the invalidity pension shall be payable so long as invalidity continues provided that an insured person who has been in receipt of the invalidity pension for not less less than the five continuous years or attains the age specified in clause a of subsection 1 of section 22 shall be entitled to the invalidity pension for life hope you have understood the provisions of this very act thank you very much indeed